All right, everybody, welcome to the Zabecast. Zabe, Scotty, Al. Hey, I was thinking, you know, uh, end of the year, I should uh, do a little segment on your favorite sound bites on the show. I have my favorites, my treasured audio gems, some of which really can't be found out in the wild. People keep insisting that I post them and I release them to the wild. No, you own them. They're in the Zabin Zoo of sound files. <laughs> right, I, and I don't want to. Like, one of my favorites, and I think you would agree, would be the Yao Ming translator soundbite talking about what he likes to eat. Have you ever had snake? No, have you? Of course. Ooh. Of course? Uh-huh. Snake, of course. Uh-huh. Really? What else? Chihuahua. Chihuahua. Frog. 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 Now, why do you like that bite so much? Because I know it tickles you. I... Uh, is it the Leslie Visser reaction? Yes, it's absolutely the Leslie Visser. She goes, oh, snake? <laughs> and she's just trying to be all cutesy. And Yao, as we've now learned, has a whale of a sense of humor. And he was interested. I think he actually got the shock value of the Chinese food translation right. to the American newswoman. Like, you eat that? And yeah. How about just get a kick out of it. How about just the way the translator says? Have you ever had... Snick. Translator talk is funny. It, absolutely it is. Uh, Galdi, what's one of your favorite sound bites that we have in the collection? Uh, one that we've added this year is the Paterno BCS. You like that BSB. one, don't you? I, I, cause it, yeah. Yeah, it, well, it, we can't play that because Solly has it, but that's okay. one of my favorites. Because it, 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 it really captures his co- sort of yeah. uh, not only confusion, him, Galtz, but it captures the, the D1 coach's hatred right. of the BCS, at least most of them. All right, Scott, what about you? Uh, I'm always partial to, ooh, the Germans. That one's very, very funny to me. That's from The Simpsons, though. That can be had. I'm talking things that are rare. Like, how about Al Davis talking about the tuck rule? You guys like that one? That is good. Davis. Yes. The head of officials is still out there trying to spin it that we had a tuck rule. You can hear his indignance, by the way. And that was really not a fumble. I mean, it's ridiculous. <laughs> it was ridiculous. Right. He's that was from five tinge. years ago, that interview with ESPN. He hadn't mm-hmm. done anything with them one-on-one in quite some time. How about any snowball bites? Do you like the Sims snowball better? The Sims snowball bite. Or do you bite. like the Weish snowball the better? The Sims snowball bite Sims. because you can. But I always find it interesting. What are you? Whoa. This guy hit by a snowball, and I see the guy that threw it. And you ain't doing nothing about it that, either, pal. That's from the tuck rule game. Right? It is from the tuck rule yeah. game. Yeah, the, the reaction, the sound. Yeah. Of but I always oh. find it interesting. What are you? Whoa. Huh. The, the thump precedes the what are you doing. But I always find it interesting. What are you? Whoa. Thump, what are you? Yes. That one is rare. That's You cannot get that anywhere. No, that's raw here. human Never. emotion and reaction right there. You now, the Weish one you can get because that's famous. It was caught on camera. Well, the next person that sees anybody throw anything onto this field, point them out and get them out of here. You don't live in Cleveland. You live in Cincinnati. Tell you the crowd ramping up just gives me chills every that's time. That's a pop, yeah. That is a great. That's a very wrestling yeah, pop. It really isn't it? is. It really is. And it was a shoot too. Yeah, absolutely. Because yeah. that was not scripted. No, no, not at all. He grabbed the house mic and went into business for himself. <laughs> wrestling. Terms. All wrestling terms. All right. Well, those are some of my favorites. Hope Hol- you enjoy holiday them. classics. Holiday classics, if you will, they from are. the first team on Fox. Thanks for listening, folks. We will see you next time.